This is News Tonight. Good evening, I'm Glenda Chong. Tonight's top stories. Singapore has reported its highest number of locally transmitted COVID-19 infections in around five weeks. Eight bus interchanges have been identified as clusters. Singapore and Australia to share COVID vaccines, Australia to receive half a million Pfizer doses, and Canberra says the shots will be returned in December. The Taliban declares victory and is now in charge of Afghanistan after the last US troops leave the country, marking the end of a 20-year war. Also tonight, coffee shops getting ready for diners to return their trays as the clock ticks down for people to clear up. Singapore has reported the highest number of locally transmitted COVID-19 infections in around five weeks. That's when the country first came out of the phase two heightened alert. Of the 156 today, 79 are unlinked. Now, of the 77 linked cases, 48 were already under quarantine, while 29 were detected through surveillance. There are two seniors above 70 years old who are not fully vaccinated and are at risk of serious illness. There are five imported cases, and that's a total of 161 new cases. There is a growing number of cases linked to eight different bus interchanges. So far, around 229 people, including bus captains, are infected.